So this has been such a crazy good year for custard apple. Last year just didn't get very much. So we've been thinning uh, some of these clusters of fruit because we'd like more of the resources to go to one fruit or a couple fruits rather than several. And also we don't want the tree to be too stressed by making too many fruit. Sort of even out the production, hopefully next year we have a good crop also. So after our video on thinning custard apple, uh, one of our viewers commented that we could ripen the immature fruit and that they would be good. I've actually never tried this, so thanks viewer. I will now have the next experiment in custard apples. Here's three easy ones to pick. We will just ripen these and see what they taste like. They're much smaller than, whoops, the size that I normally um, pick them. And they aren't at even a little bit ripe. But you never know until you try. So if you hear something that sounds unusual but possible, try it out. So nine days ago, we took these fruit off of the tree. As you can tell, they're a lot smaller than the, the ones that we left on, plus these have had nine days to grow. So anyway, out of these three, this one is the softest and it's turning color a little bit. So one of our YouTube viewers said, you could just ripen those fruit that you thinned from the tree. So, I'll try it. I I'm not convinced that this is going to taste good at all, but you never know until you try. That's actually pretty good. I'm very surprised. I thought it was gonna be all seed and not very tasty. There's a little patch that didn't have much flavor, but first bite was pretty darn good. We happen to have the first custard apple of the season. It's pretty small compared to what a lot of these will be but this one should taste just perfectly normal and so I'll just take this little wedge out and it is a delicious fruit I'll just take a little bite of this oh yeah this is pretty good this is really good it's just very creamy and sweet, very delicious fruit. So we just saw this on the tree, I think it was two days ago when it started to color up and now it is perfectly ripe. And there's a inside of the fruit, very lovely fruit. Custard apple, Anona reticulata. But we've been keeping our eye on all of these fruit. We want to, to pick it when it's at its peak, when it's fully mature but hasn't started to ripen, because when it starts to ripen, animals smell it and they like dash for the tree. It is really, really popular with squirrels and such. Uh, in fact, this one is one that we've been, been watching. And this morning, unfortunately, found that a, I think that's a squirrel that got into that fruit. 
I guess the good news is that at this stage, uh, it, this flesh heals up. This is not rotting, it just sort of uh, scarred up, you might say. So this should ripen perfectly fine. And I guess another fortunate thing about this fruit is that since it does have this damage on it, we won't be selling it. So, hey, another one for me. <laughs> so anyway, custard apple. It is possible to eat the fruit when you pick it really young, but it's really, really good if you can eat the fully mature fruit.